Why virtual reality will be the next big revolution. Many people associate virtual reality with science fiction films such as Minority Report. However, the truth is that this technology is now completely integrated into our daily lives. Gaming, medicine, education, virtual reality is not going away. But what exactly is it, and how will it be the next big thing? Let's dive into today's video with Metagen to know what will be VR's future. Watch till the end and join Metagen to never miss out on more videos like this. Here we begin. Virtual reality is a computer-generated environment with realistic-looking scenes and objects that immerses the user in their surroundings. This environment is perceived by using a virtual reality headset or helmet. VR enables us to immerse ourselves in video games as if we were one of the characters, learn how to perform heart surgery, and improve the quality of sports training in order to achieve peak performance. Although this appears to be very far in the future, its origins are less recent than we might think. For example, many people believe that one of the first virtual reality devices was called Sensorama, a machine with a built-in seat that played 3D movies, emitted odors, and generated vibrations to enhance the experience. This invention was made in the mid-1950s. Over the next few years, subsequent technology and software advancements brought about a general and gradual evolution of both devices and interface design. How is it different from augmented reality? Despite being a decades older technology, many people still need to familiarize themselves with virtual reality. As a result, mixing up terms is common. It's important to remember though, virtual reality and augmented reality are different. The primary distinction between the two is that VR creates a world in which we immerse ourselves using a specific headset. It is completely immersive, and everything we see is part of an environment created artificially through images, sounds, and so on. In augmented reality, on the other hand, our own world becomes a framework within op where which objects, images, or similar are placed. As a result, everything we see is real and wearing a headset may be optional. Pokemon Go is the clearest and most popular example of this concept. However, there is a mixed reality that combines both realities. This hybrid technology, for example, allows you to see virtual objects in real life and create an experience in which the physical and digital are virtually indistinguishable. How is the metaverse involved? The term metaverse literally means another world. The phrase Internet of Things has long been used to describe a future version of the internet that would keep us constantly connected to one another. Since the concept's inception, Various terms have been used to describe the metaverse. Humans and digital energies can create, communicate, work, play games, run businesses, and socialize in a digital domain. A virtual shared space is a nexus of real and virtual worlds. Any program, service, or platform that allows you to interact with other people or digital things in a virtual environment is included in the metaverse. Pokemon Go and Facebook's Horizon Workrooms are two examples of how the metaverse could look into the future of augmented reality and virtual collaboration. The metaverse could have a full-fledged economy and unprecedented interoperability, and users must be able to transport their avatars and in-world commodities from one area of the metaverse to another, regardless of who governs that area. According to Zuckerberg, the embodied internet would be decentralized by many different parties, with no single firm in charge. However, the concept of a metaverse now appears to be close to reality as a result of investments made by tech giants and smaller companies, such as Roblox, Epic Games, and Niantic, in developing metaverse features. Facebook may have an advantage now that it may come from a social standpoint. Facebook also controls Oculus, its virtual reality division. Facebook spent $2 billion on Oculus VR headsets, which have limited features. The metaverse will only be successful if the hardware can provide users with a natural sense of protection in the digital world, as Facebook hopes. Ways VR will change our lives. Tools for creative newsrooms. The information industry is another promising sector for VR applications, with the New York Times being the first major US daily to launch its own VR app for mobile devices. This app, already available for Android and iOS, requires a Google Cardboard device. After installing the app, you choose a newspaper story in which you can quickly become completely immersed. The resulting experience can be described as a journey alongside the reporter who wrote the story, with the user being able to experience images in 3D while turning their head to decide what to explore next. Users will encounter a new type of video that gives you a sense of depth in every direction, making you feel like you're actually there. New Shopping Experience one of the most significant VR contributions will be related to the shopping sector, particularly for handcrafted and one-of-a-kind items. 
Prospective buyers will be able to participate in an immersive storytelling experience, following the production process from start to finish. This promises an incredibly experience for consumers, allowing them to appreciate products more deeply and authentically. Furthermore, as a natural extension of the images and videos currently used in this field, this will lead to marketing strategies based on VR applications. The New World for Video Games VR technology will undoubtedly have a significant impact on the video game industry. Several leading companies are creating VR-only games as tools for a diverse fan base. Among those is Virtuex's Virtuex Omni platform, which uses a headset and a joystick to explore a parallel world. Playing in a full VR environment will undoubtedly be a lot of fun. The VR gaming market will be worth $5.1 billion by the end of 2016 according to Superdata. Traveling from home Mark Zuckerberg announced his own VR project at the F8 Facebook Developer Conference in March. A drone equipped with several video cameras allowing people to see Venice and choose from a complete 360 degree view of its mountains in a video that played on a large screen. This is just one of many potential applications that the tourism and travel industries are working on. The Future of Virtual Reality Virtual reality is one of the technologies with the greatest growth potential. According to the most recent IDC Richards forecasts, investment in VR and AR will more than double over the next four years, reaching 15.5 billion euros by 2022. Furthermore, both technologies will be critical to compare digital transformation plans with spending in this area exceeding that of the consumer sector by 2019. As a result, it is expected that by 2020, more than half of the largest European companies will have a VR and RA strategy. In today's market, users want applications that go beyond leisure, tourism, or marketing, and are more affordable. Virtual interfaces must also be improved to avoid flaws like clipping, which causes certain solid objects to appear as if they can be passed through, or to mitigate the effect that VR has on people, such as motion sickness, characterized by dizziness caused by a mismatch between our body's movement and what is seen as the virtual world. The major technology companies are already working on developing headsets that do not require cables and can display images in high definition. In addition, they are working on 8K virtual reality headsets with much more powerful processors. There is even talk of incorporating artificial intelligence in the coming years. The most recent 5G standard may also provide interesting VR evolution scenarios. This standard will enable the connection of more devices and large user communities. Furthermore, its near imperceptible latency will allow consumers to receive images in real time, almost as if they were seeing them with their own eyes. All of this means that virtual reality is no longer a sci-fi concept. Instead, it is a part of the present, leading to advances shaping the future in the next coming years. What do you think about virtual reality as the next big revolution? Let us know in the comments below, and subscribe for more uploads like this. See you soon!